So now the next thing is basically to design and implement the login screen. So for that purpose, let's just close all these and right click on authentication new dot file login screen material dot dot we will create a stateful widget we will give it name as login screen and then we will simply change this to scaffold body single child scroll view the color of this will be color stored black child column widget for now here when where we have our splash screen okay let's change this to instead of sign up screen we will change it to login screen and now let's just restart the app so here you can see this is our login screen first of all just like we did on the sign up screen if you come here on the sign up screen we have add here basically a size box and the logo the same thing we will do here okay first of all make sure to add as you know this is a column widget and column is multi children widget so we have to add children and in here paste it okay so this is our image and after this let's quickly add this uh, title same goes here okay and we will say login as our driver instead of registration since you know this is our login screen now after the title of course we need two things which is the email and password text editing controller and of course only email and password text field we will use so anyways let's just copy this quickly okay email password and then after it the email text field and then after it we have the password text field which is this one so yes okay email password and one thing is click here before this column C and you will see yellow bulb red wrap with padding give it 20 padding from all sides let's change this uh, size box height to 30 okay and now after the email field I mean after the this is email then we have password so after the password we want to basically display a button so on the sign up screen if you remember we have our elevated button just copy it from here and we will paste it on the login screen and we will change the name of it to login also make sure to comment out this navigator okay comment out this because we do not need to send the user from here to the car info screen okay so just comment out or even you can remove it okay we do not need it and then uh, next thing is let's add size box we have to add a text button here so that we can allow the driver 
to navigate to the registration page so after the elevated button we can use the text button so we can say child text so we can say already have an account login here and then of course we will apply some text style on it the color will be colors dot gray and then after it we have another property for the text button which is on pressed which is where we want to send the driver after clicking on it so first of all make sure to add here const modifier so we want to send the user to a page which is by the name sign up screen okay yeah and now if we hot restart and click on this then here you can see now the same thing we will do here so let's just copy this whole text button and on the sign up screen after the elevated button we can simply paste this and by the way this one will be here on the registrations page okay that is let's say if the driver has already an account then the driver will log in I mean click on this that is log in here let me just quickly change this sign up screen okay so we can change this to um, login screen okay so if now if we click here it will send to the login page and on the login instead of displaying this we can say do not have an account you can say register here or you can say sign up here just like this okay so now it looks good do not have an account sign up here and then already have an account